Hey, what up everybody? This is Stevie Breach coming to you here today. Anybody who is a uh, a real big NXT fan who wants to watch the show week in and week out, who wants no spoilers, please stick away from this video. Uh, as of right now, the uh, title of this video is Shinsei Nakamura's first w I'm sorry, WWE debut match and um it'll be that way. Um, just so hopefully, um, you know, if you want don't want to know, this is your last chance, you know, please get the hell out of here. Um, but, uh, it was announced today at the, uh, NXT tapings, which is going to be shown over, uh, the next few weeks leading up, uh, until WrestleMania that the big match at NXT TakeOver, I believe it's called NXT TakeOver Dallas, the WrestleMania weekend NXT TakeOver. Can you believe for the people who are actually staying home, uh, er not everybody goes to WrestleMania, but I mean, like... For the people, like, like, like some people only do the WWE Network from month to month, and uh, maybe a month is coming up and they have a pay-per-view that they don't really like that much, they're not going to subscribe to the network. You know, I've been subscribed since day number one, and I don't think I'll ever unsubscribe to the network unless I really run low on money or something like that. But um, I've always thought that it's going to be an awesome value. But for those people who go month to month, not only are you going to get WrestleMania during the month for $9.99 on the WWE Network, you're going to get an NXT TakeOver special which has been like lights out. Every single one of these has been dynamite. Really, really good, strong shows. And that's going to be the night before WrestleMania. Right there. If, if you're not going to tell me that those two shows aren't worth five bucks a piece, you're fucking bananas. But uh, the I, I don't think this is going to be the main event, but it definitely is going to be the attraction match that brings a lot of people in. If you've been watching... um. Uh, TV over the last little while. I was thinking that it was going to be Apollo Crews um, going up against um, Finn Balor for the championship. But obviously with this match, um, the, it, it might be going down. But it was sort of rumored out there that it was going to be uh, Sami Zayn against Finn Balor at the Dallas show. But uh, it was announced today that uh, Shinsei Nakamura will be making his WWE NXT debut wrestling on the NXT Dallas show against Sami Zayn. That's a fucking awesome matchup. That is a way to bring somebody in and really, uh, you know, show them off right out of the gate. Sami Zayn is a really, really great wrestler. He has great matches with just about anybody that he's had a match with inside of NXT. And uh, it, it, we've seen him in the Royal Rumble. We've seen him against John Cena. Um, I, I don't know why he's still in NXT and not a part of the main roster. Maybe it's because Triple H is seeing what happened with... Uh, um, with uh, Tyler Breeze and uh, maybe bringing him up to the main roster as of right now isn't the best idea because people like Kevin Dunn and Vince McMahon will hold him down maybe because of his size. But this is a guy, if you want there to be a new Daniel Bryan, this is the guy. I mean, um, uh, get, get out there and watch some El Generico. Watch some Sami Zayn matches if you haven't seen it. But definitely Shinsei Nakamura is coming in with a whole lot of appeal. I mean, uh, immediately when my buddy um, Pinko texted me about this match, my, my first thoughts that were running through um, was, was Nakamura being a part of WrestleMania weekend. Um, and then you're know, thinking like, wow, Shinsei Nakamura is going to be at Access. Uh, that was one of my first thoughts when AJ Styles debuted at the Royal Rumble. was like, wow, people are going to meet AJ Styles at Access. And um, that's going to be dynamite. That's probably going to be one of the, the guys that people are really, really wanting to meet during WrestleMania weekend. Um, there's always somebody who steps up and it's like, that's the guy that I want to meet. And as of right now, he's not a VIP. I mean, like uh, Shinsei Nakamura is probably going to be doing autograph signings at Access in the NXT line, which never has a line. If you think about last year, last year I met Kevin Owens twice. In the matter of 15 minutes, I met him near the end of like the first part of a session, and then I went out of the line, and then basically saw that new people had, had switched out at the NXT table, came back to the NXT line, and because I wanted to meet Blake and Murphy who were in, in there, and then just Kevin Owens just came out again and just started signing for people. I met Kevin Owens twice within 15 minutes at Access, and this year, if you want to meet Kevin Owens, take a picture and get an autograph. It's a hundred bucks. Um, honestly, if you're going to access it and you see Sensei Mar Nakamura over there, get in that fucking line. This guy, there's no way in the world this guy is not going to be a big star. And this match at NXT TakeOver against Sami Zayn is going to be 16 stars. Not 5, not 6, not 10. 16 stars. Guaranteed.